In order to join the Ultimate PASCAC Readers Reading Challenge for 2017, you need to make a Goodreads account. So I'm just going to show you how to make an account and then join the PASCAC, the Ultimate PASCAC group. So I've got a student uh, name, email address, Put in your password, and sign up. Sometimes they, they, there's an extra verification screen. If you get that screen, just do it a couple of times. Uh, they're just verifying that it's a real person and not a robot. We're going to skip this step for the moment. This is not our challenge. What this is is the Goodreads challenge, and this is the actually the 2016 challenge. So we're going to skip this step as well. Next, you're going to select your favorite genres. This is a way that Goodreads gets to know you as a reader. So you pick the books or the type of books, the genre of books that you are comfortable reading, that you enjoy reading, and they will make recommendations based on some of these. Uh, selections, but not it's by far not the only thing that they'll show you. Continue. This is books that they want to kind of understand what kind of reader you are. So they're going to ask you to rate about 20 books. If you've read any of these books, you can just uh, rate them with stars. It's not an absolute necessity that you uh, participate in this, but if you read The Nanny Diaries or this, what will happen is they will pick out more books like that that they think that you might like. So I'll go through here a little bit and um, see if there's anything you like. And sometimes like these are a little bit too much chiclet for me, but uh, we're just going to skip past this because you don't really need to do it. I'm finished rating. Now it can't make any recommendations because you really only rated two books, but you can go down here and say I'm done, see what's next. Okay, so now you are in, but what I'd like to do is direct you to community. From community go to groups and type in ultimate PASCAC readers. Click on search. You'll find our group here. Once you're here, click on join the group. It will ask you, uh, this is about how you would want to get email from the group. I usually just click digest so that anything that any email that comes comes all at once. Join the group. Now go down here to the middle of the page where it says 2017 reading challenge and you uh, read here where it says I want to read let's say 20 books. You think you can read 20 books this year. Enter a shelf for this challenge. This is an important step because you can be in several different challenges at one time. So any only the books that are logged on to this shelf will be counted towards your challenge. So I'm going to call this challenge my um, winter challenge. You can call it my books. You can call it 2017 books. Uh, I'm just going to you know, pick anything off the top of your head and remember it. So I'm going to click on save. So now what happens is you get this little progression bar that says zero out of 20 books have been read. So the next step is how do you populate that? If you go up here to search books, I'm going to search for a book that um, I think I'd like to read or I did read, uh, Underground Railroad by Colson Whitehead. Click on that. 
you'll see that it gives you a nice uh, synopsis of the book. But the important part is over here, want to read. You got a little uh, green rectangle, and if you click on the down arrow, it gives you three options, read, currently reading, or want to read. And it also gives you a radio button that you have to click. So I am uh, currently reading. Let's say I'm currently reading this book, and I'm putting it on my Winter Challenge bookshelf. You don't have to save anything, it'll automatically save. So now let's just pretend that two weeks have gone by and I finished Underground Railroad. So I go back to the down arrow, I click on re uh, red, indicating that I've read the book already. It will launch another uh, window that asks you to rate the book. It You don't have to rate it, but you do have to make sure it's on your um, your uh, challenge shelf and you have to date it. So if I uh, finish this on December 16th, I started it on December 1st and that's enough to have it count. You go up here okay, and go to save. It has now, now should be populated on your uh, progression bar. So if I go back, and let me move this over for a second, this little uh, box over here on the top navigation bar is your account essentially. I'm going to go down here to my groups. Be careful, this My Reading Challenge is not the PASCAC Reading Challenge. This is Goodreads Reading Challenge, which you could also participate in if you want to. My groups, again. And you can bookmark this page, go to Ultimate PASCAC Readers, and you will see that one of 20 books has been read by. Um, and, and if I click on that, you'll see that it is the Colson Whitehead Underground Railroad book. And as the year goes on, keep adding books. And hopefully you'll be able to meet your challenge. Thank you.